Hi guys, PD here, welcome to the channel, welcome to another new video. Today we're playing Ragnarok on Steam, I'm playing on the Oculus Rift S today. Uh, this is a rhythm game, I picked it up this morning, £15 on Steam, so let's dive in. Okay guys, here on the game, this looks really really nice. I'm loving the art style already. How to play? Crush the runes on the drums. Okay, so this is the tutorial, guys. I'm going to uh, learn as I go along. Okay. Controls, PvP, solo mode. Uh, let me check out the options. Graphics are on high. Let's put that on high. Super high. Everything on super high. Audio, haptics. Okay. So let's jump into the uh, solo player game. I'm sitting down. I'm sitting away from my, my desk over here. Um, I don't want to hit my desk when I'm um, playing the game. So let me just sit back in my chair. I've just noticed there's a bear on the floor. Like a bear rug. Okay. So these are the songs, different songs. Quite a few songs to choose from. So let's do the uh, first one. Call of the North. Okay, so drums and hammer settings. Okay, I feel too, I'm in the drum set. I need to uh, reset my view, I think. Redefine your center by clicking the left and right trigger. Okay, there we go. There's like a drum there. Look at this place. The snow coming down. This looks really, really nice, guys. Behind me is a Viking village look. Okay, so let's start. Let me uh, bash the drum over there. Oh, okay, so this is like a... Loving the music already. I do love uh, rhythm games in VR. Uh, this looks unique. There's something really satisfying about bashing drums in VR. I feel like um, I want the drum set to be a bit lower down though. They feel a bit too high up for me. I'm missing notes here look. My hands are too high up. Let me do this song. Is that a waterfall? Okay, this is my practice room, guys. Um, my arms are hurting. I'm having to raise them too high up. I feel like I need to be sitting higher up in the um, in the game. Now it could be because I'm sat down in a chair, I might need to reset my view.
Yeah, my arms are hurting. Hold on. Okay, I'm too high or I'm too... I feel too low. Okay, use the left or right joystick to just jump high. Oh, there we go. Oh, that's better. Okay. Okay, let me let me get into a position here. I don't want to hit my table. My table's here. So, is that about right? Maybe about there. Okay. That would do. And we can... Oh, okay. We can adjust the uh, hammer as well. Okay, that's cool. And we've got some advanced options here. Lots of um, configuration here with the uh, with the drums, pretty cool. Okay, so I'm going to try that again, guys. Restart the song. What's the uh, symbols for? Okay. Okay, this feels better. Okay, I'm now hitting the arms of my chair. I'm going to have to get another chair. What's that do? Okay, that makes them grow faster. I do like the concept. Look at these uh, graphics. This is going to be a really good workout for your arms. Loving the songs. Yeah, games like this make you feel really powerful, guys. I do feel like I need to be a bit further back though as well. Uh, this game's getting very positive reviews at the moment on Steam. I can see why. What a really cool concept. Ooh. Okay, so on my left of my stats, notes hit, notes missed. Um, perfect combo distance. I got bronze. Okay, I'm going to change my uh, chair, guys. The chair I normally sit in for doing a VR has got um, handles on it. So um, just give me a minute. I'm going to get a chair with no um, no arms on it. And I have to be really careful my um, PCs here. So I don't want to be swinging out, hitting my PC. Make sure you've got nothing around you. I'm just going to reconfigure my uh, view again with the new chair. Um, hold that. I need to be really careful when I hit this drum on my left, uh, my fireplaces here. Um, so if I want to use, I'll probably use this one here. Okay. So you need to get yourself really comfortable in the game. Um, let's go to the main menu. Let's try a new song. So that's the same song. I think these are, are difficult levels. 
So let me try this chomp chomp. I do believe with each new song you get new, um, yeah, new locations. Look at this. Uh, this game feels really polished, guys. Look at these views. This is a fast song. This feels really refreshing. And a good price as well. £15. Endless hours of fun. Yeah, this is going to be a really good workout. Once you've got your setup right, you don't really have to look down at the drums, you just swing at the notes. And it's all about muscle memory, guys. I've played a few drum rhythm games so far this is the best one guys really enjoying this And this is on easy mode. There's a volcano. Okay, what do we do? Is that gold? Did I get a gold medal for that? I want to do the first one again now. Now I'm comfortable. I want to do the first song again. I'm picking up points. I, know, I don't know what the points are. So let me do the uh, first song again. Now I'm nice and comfortable. Play against the ghost. Oh, there's a ghost ship. Is that my score? Is that my best score from the last time I played? Bum, 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 bum. Okay, so when my hammers flush, I'm going to hit the drums on my on my right. 
get a speed boost. I think they uh, flush when you get a combo. Bum, 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 bum. Bum, bum, bum. Where are you going? Uh, this might look easy, but it's not as easy as it looks. That sounds like the uh, Terminator song. Bam, 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 bam. There's a bit of haptic feedback on the controller, there's not much. My wrist straps are banging against my controllers, I need to um, put them on right. Okay, let me put my wrist straps on. Let's try the same song on um, level two. I do like the song. Let me try um, try this one lot. So I've got bronze on easy mode. This will be a bit harder. I don't know what the uh, four hammers are. Okay, there's no ghost on here, so. So for those of you wondering what this game's like, uh, these um, patterns are coming towards me, very similar to Beat Saber. Um, I've got this 3D ship in front of me, I've got this Viking ship, these um, characters are realistic. I'm getting carried away by the amazing backgrounds, I know there's a waterfall up there. Terminator Really satisfying I did uh, reach out to the developers for a key, they never got back to me, so I just brought the game this morning, guys. I hit my computer there, see what I mean? You have to make sure you've got nothing in front of you. At the moment, my knees are in the way. 
Okay, I might need to um, raise the drums a bit higher. I keep hitting my knees now. Okay, crush the runes. What is that? Are these achievements? Okay. Let's try a new song. Let's go for a dead and gone. Okay, let me reset these a bit higher up. So I'm not quite hitting my knees. Okay, let's try that one. I guess this is a really good game to train your hand to eye coordination. So if you want to uh, be a drummer in real life, this will give you some really good practice. Yeah, good job guys. Okay, really enjoying this guys. Okay, look at those scores here, look. Okay. Let's check out a new song. Do we? Okay, I'm starting to see the um, same locations now. So I guess it's uh, very limited to You've only got a few locations each time. As you can tell from the soundtrack, a very interesting soundtrack. A mixture of like rock, Celtic music, and uh, pirate shanties.
So that ghost score must have been my my score, my previous score. When I'm doing the new levels, there's no um, ghost shit. Okay, silver medal. So I wonder if this is like the uh, difficulty level, the uh, two hammers. Slowly getting better. New high score. Okay, let's try the uh, drunken dwarves. So it looks like there's two to three different locations. Some of my favourite VR games are rhythm games. Beat Saber, Synth Riders. This is one of those games I can see becoming very addictive. And if you're not a fan of like the Beat Saber type songs, And you're more into Metallica, that sort of thing. This is probably more ideal for you. Something really satisfying about drumming in VR. Because you're there, because this was so real, your brain thinks it's real. So it's like being sat in front of a real drum kit. And as a bonus, you don't get to annoy your neighbours. You get to uh, beat your drums and keep the uh, neighbours happy. It feels really cool when you pull off the uh, combos as well. Okay, my left touch battery is low. So I'll do one more song after this. Before my uh, controllers pack up. If you guys think this looks satisfying, I can tell you now it's really satisfying. So if you think it looks fun on the screen, you should try it in VR.
Okay, that was really, really cool. Okay, one more song. My controllers, the batteries are about to go. Heroes. So the number must be the difficulty level. Yeah, this is a tricky combo. Okay, both my controller batteries are going. We might not make it to the end of this level. You can do it, batteries. I recommend this game, it's going to get my Steam approval. I'm going to give it a Steam recommendation. I do like this song. Got some really interesting combos this song. So when they go ooh, that's me hitting that drum on the right. If you guys have ever played Beat Saber and you know how satisfying Beat Saber is, this is very similar. Well, instead of slicing the blocks, you're bashing the drums. I just bang my funny bone on the chair behind me. I know it's not funny. So that gives you a speed boost as well. If you hit the drum on the right or the left, it gives you a speed boost. And it feels really satisfying when you pull off the combos. VR is amazing guys, no doubt about it. Okay, there we go. Thank you for watching, I hope you enjoyed the video. Please leave a like and subscribe. Be sure to my little bell, I'll see you in the next one. Bye! That was awesome. I really enjoyed that.